Hello YouTube, Dylan here, and in today's video, I am going to show you how to draw Tom the Cat's most famous mouse rival, Jerry. So, grab a pencil and piece of paper, sit back, relax, let's go. We want to start with the top of Jerry's head, which will start out as a circle, which is like what we most do in most drawings typically human drawings. And then we're gonna put a sideways oval at the bottom. And then we'll put a center line down the middle to know where the middle of her face will go. And then we're gonna draw like a kind of a squashed vertical oval for the body. And remember, like I always say, draw lightly at first until you get the lines you want and you so that you can cover up the lines you don't want very easily. And then you'll draw these kind of round triangular oval shapes for the arms. And then at the bottom, we'll draw two triangular shapes for the legs. and put ovals at the bottom for the feet. Okay, that's our base, those are our basic building blocks for Jerry. Now it's time to draw her face. Let's start with the eyes. And these eyes, just like Tom's eyes, they're these long ovals with the little skinniness at the bottom. Just like this. That's just the stop the eyes. And then you'll draw two smaller ovals inside for the pupils. Then you can color those in dark. And then we're gonna draw her nose. Her nose will go down between the middle of her eyes like this it's a soft triangle or so like an upside down teardrop really small and then put a small sideways oval on it for like the highlight and fill the rest of the nose in okay now we need to draw her the rest of her face This is only her nose area. So let's draw her cheeks. And then right above her eyes, we're gonna draw her eyelashes. Cause remember eyelashes are important on a female character and they stick out like this. Just like that. Now, we should get the side of her face a little. Typically, and the top as well. And now we need to draw her eyebrows. You only see half of the one on this side and this one will be like this. And it's gonna be like a half moon. And then we draw the lower part of her face. And now we have to draw her whiskers. 
one right here will be one will be smaller and one will be slightly longer like that and then we'll th this side will draw one that's a little longer and one that's a little smaller like that now we've got to draw her mouth she's gonna be smiling so we'll draw this shallow u shape that goes underneath her nose area and stops at her cheek and then we have to draw her tongue that goes like that and then you can very lightly shade her mouth in not all the way black it's a bit of a it can be grayish but unless you have a dark red colored pencil you can do that if you want and then we'll draw her lower lip then we need to draw a separation between her head and face it stops right there and then we'll draw another one of those like this and then we'll draw the back side of her head like that and now we need to draw her top hair And then we'll draw her ear, which will be shaped like this. It's really big and way bigger than Tom's ears and softer. So we draw this big kind of half egg shape. And then we draw a hairline that starts right here and then we curve it all the way up there to create the outer ear just like that and then up here we're going to draw a soft triangle for the other ear but it won't be the whole ear because it's hidden behind his head so we got his we got our head now we need to draw her body so we'll draw the let's create this little shape right here that's her stomach here's her armpit line And then, now, we need to draw her arm right here. And then we got our arm right there. And then we'll get the other arm. Okay, now let's draw her hand. So we'll get her thumb, and she has three fingers, just like Tom. One, two, and three. The third one will go a little down behind her middle one. So we got that. Now let's get her other arm, hey, our hand, so we'll get the top, here's one finger, that's her middle finger, two, and three.
and there's her thumb just like that so we got her hands done now all we got to do now is draw her legs so we'll get her leg that curves down like this and get another leg that curves down again and there's her other leg and now we need to draw her feet and she only has two toes And it, oh, they all, they're all C shapes. And they, this one curves, goes straight to the leg. And similar thing with over here, but this time it'll go downward this way, create a backward C shape, and one more backward C shape going straight to the leg. Okay, we look like we're done, but we're not. Remember, she has a tail. So we'll draw this little kind of straight S shape, and then we'll put another one to create a point at the end. Make sure it's thick on this side, and then it gets a little skinny to the end. Just like that. Now what we can do to finish it off, let's put a little shadow underneath her because she's standing and without a shadow, she would just look like she's floating in space and do it very lightly and use the side of your pencil. And also, it would another good reason to put a shadow is that way when a light's hitting it's she's showing that she's standing on something and there you go you have your own picture of jerry the mouse i hope you had fun thanks for watching if you feel like you did good write your name on it Hang it on your refrigerator, like this video, and hit that subscribe button. Take care. I'll see you next time.